What is up everyone, Weston here. Uh, I just bought this Pro Sport boost gauge with uh, the gauge pod off ECS tuning. Here's everything that came in it. I kind of unboxed it already. Here's the digital gauge, the uh, instructions to install it, uh, the boost sensor, the filter, the T fitting, the wiring harness for it. Um, to bolt that into there. And that's everything. So let me go ahead and install this and then I'll give a quick overview of how to install it. Alright, so I got this all installed. You have to pop all these little clips off of here. And then that comes out. And then there is four little clips in here for the other vent to blow which way. And you gotta pop that piece out. And then you can put this piece in and the gauge in. And then I drilled a little hole right here in the corner. Run all the wires through. Now I'm going to put it back in and run all the wires down through there. Also, I totally forgot to mention, to get this out, all you have to do is pull this piece off right here. And I just pried on the bottom of this and it popped out. And so I have to do to get it out. So uh, for all the wiring for the boost gauge, we're going to use the headlight switch to uh, get the headlight switch up. Push it in, twist it, and the whole thing comes out super easy all right so I had to pull the battery out and I ran a line right through the harness that comes by by the clutch kind of this car doesn't have it where the blanks at for it I ran that through there and the hose is coming through so then I have to go get an adapter to tap this and put that through there once I do that I just gotta finish up the wiring and it'll be done Right through that nipple. There we go. Oh my god. Alright, so I didn't uh, end up buying a boost tap. Instead, I went and I got, I think it's a half inch hose. And I got an adapter to go down to that. Super shitty. I just wrapped it in a lift curl tape. But uh, it does the job. So I, uh, I got all the wiring in there. Ran the cage through. Um, and now I have it so I'm going to do. Turns on and I chose blue. I put the uh, diagram in here for the switch. However, I didn't put it in for the boost gauge because they're all different. I found it super helpful with these diagrams to go ahead and wire that up. So there it is. Um, the headlights off. It's blue. And the headlights on. It's red.